Welcome back guys to another episode of Detron Does It. Of course, I am Detron and I does stuff. And this week, I'm gonna try to keep the video short but informative. Recently, I was doing a project building walls in my garage and I thought it'd be really nice to have the garage door open during this time. But I live in Texas and if I opened it, I'd be inundated with mosquitoes and wasps and spiders and all the bugs. And so I didn't, but it was miserable. So I set out to find something that could help me with my garage temperature issue. And so I got this, it's a garage door magnetic screen. Now I've seen these on the internet before. I've also seen them on Amazon a lot and I thought, there's no way that this is gonna be a good idea. It's not gonna work. It's gonna be too flimsy, too light. The wind's gonna blow it away. But then I start reading some reviews and this particular one has a screen that's made out of a heavy duty mesh and it also has magnets in the middle and heavy magnets at the bottom to keep it in place. And so I bought it. In today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how I install it and I'm also gonna give you my honest review of what this product is like in case you're in the market for something similar. As always, please like, share, subscribe, hit that notifications button, get some alerts, find out when we're dropping new videos, which is every Monday and sometimes in the middle of the week. And if you decide not to like, share, or subscribe, you know what? I won't even be mad at you. All right, let's get started with showing you guys where we're gonna have to install this thing.
All right, so first impressions, the thing is, I mean, it's as advertised. Uh, logistically speaking, though, it is a bit of a headache. I mean, if you're in and out of your garage a lot uh, with a car, you got to lift it up or roll it up every time. That's not ideal. Um, if you have kids like me, you see in the clip that I showed you guys, uh, the kids are definitely interested in going in and out of it. It'll hold up to them passing through, but I doubt very seriously that it's going to hold up to kids pulling on it. So just know that uh, if you have children who are going to be in and out or even pets that are going to be in and out of that screen. I don't like the way that it looks when it's rolled up and left outside of the garage door, but honestly, you don't have any other choice. Hey, don't back out. Don't back out. The Velcro holds up the screen pretty well, but the sticky on the back of the Velcro would be the concern. So make sure you clean your area around your garage really well before you apply it, because if not, you're definitely gonna be dealing with it unsticking. It comes with some push pins, so I would advise using the push pins to ensure that that Velcro strip does not move before you put your screen up. Because once you put it up, it's kind of a headache to remove it, knock in pieces, put it back up, remove it, knock in pieces, um, which is what I did. So far, it has held up to the breeze. No major winds have come through. And honestly, I don't anticipate it holding up against major winds. I appreciate you guys watching. Hit that notifications button. Get some alerts. Find out when we're dropping new videos, which is every Monday and sometimes in the middle of the week. And if you decide not to like, share, or subscribe, you know what? I won't even be mad at you. Till next time, guys. Peace. No.